Good evening, basketball fans. Welcome to Cashton. Ken Manning, Western Wisconsin Video Productions, LLC. The JV game getting started here. We're going to get a shot up and in right away for the Eagles. They'll get things started with Lincoln Kling picking up a bucket and a 2-0 lead early on here for the Eagles as they take on the Sparta Spartans. Interesting uh, matchup here. Uh, Scenic Bluffs and uh, MVC conference representatives. As we take a look, as you can see, early uh, moments, early seconds, I guess we could even say, of this basketball game. <clears throat> Getting things uh, going here, we'll take a look at the Eagles and tell you who is out there right now. We have number two and Noah Hemmerschbach. Here's a shot up, no good. Oh boy, Doug, that was a hard hit right there. We're gonna take a timeout. Well, that was Brett Hammerschbach who took a shot, able to get up and uh, check out, make sure he's okay. That was a tough hit, accidental hit, <clears throat> and uh, good sportsmanship. The young man from Sparta coming over and patting him on the back. Not, uh, not anything that he wanted to do, that's for sure. Let's go back and take a look again, number 33. Jacob Hunsinger in the game. He's right here in front of us. Up on the top, number 12. There's a shot, a little bit short. 12 is uh, Brady Hemmerspach coming down the court. Noah Hemmerspach is going to be tied up, and he will be fouled. Over on the far side, number 42, and Jack Kleba coming into the ball game. He comes in for Hemmerschbach. Brett, who had to come out of that game after that tough hit. So let's see uh, where we're sitting here. We got Hunsinger, Hemmerschbach, Hemmerschbach. Oh, and uh, 44, we said, is uh, Lincoln Kling. He already has a bucket. Second shot is up and good for uh, Noah. <clears throat> Three, nothing to score. Here's a nice open look. Boy, I tell you what, good little drive there. That was 24 and Logan Wally picking up the two. Quick inside pass. Hunsinger, that rolls around and drops in. Two for him and now a lob pass. Trying to get the ball out. It's gonna be a breakaway and oh, Pretty good hustle there by Hemmerschbach. I think he's gonna be hit with the foul. Got him on the body. Well, it looks like uh, Brett Hemmerschbach is back on the bench and he's gonna be back into the ball game. Won't take long for him to uh, shake off that, that shot. Five, two, the score. Trying to get the uh, numbers here for Sparta. That shot rolled around and kicked out. With the rebound, that was Kling. Over here on the near side. Kleba with a good look. That's just over the top and falls off to the right. No good. He'll come down the court here. That's number 15 in uh, Braden True. True being guarded by Hemmerschbach. Back up to the top here now with uh, Zanon. He has the ball looking over to the right-hand side. Now comes back to the left with the left hand. Dishes off an open shot. It's a good for a three. That was number uh, 24 and Wally. He has all five points for the Spartans and they tie up this ball game. As you can see, five apiece. The ball bouncing around on the floor, kicked outside to Hunsinger, to Hammerspach. He takes a one-handed shot and hit it. Had to hang in the air, three points for him tonight. 13-18 remaining here in this first half action. Glad to have everyone on board and we 
want to say thanks to all those terrific sponsors supporting today's broadcast. Of course, American Family Insurance, the Phil Strand Agency, along with ADRC, this Agent and Disability Resource Center of Vernon County, located right there in Viroqua. 13-10 to go. Hunsinger looking down low, but they go up to the top to Hemmerschbach, who's back into the ball game. <clears throat> That's Brett. Here is Noah. Back over to uh, Kling. And trying to come up with the shot. Flipped it up in the air. That was Kling. And let's see if they're going to give it a foul on the floor. And now a timeout coming up here by the Eagles. We'll take a timeout ourselves. We'll be back after this. Well, we'll come back to uh, more of those fine uh, sponsors as they're ready to get this game underway. Well, we thought they were. Now they're going to get things going. Here's the uh, pass down inside. Back out to the top, that is Zanon. Looks over to that far side. Let's see if we can catch the number. Good move inside there, that is 45 in uh, Shendo. That's Tyler Shendo, 23 is Landon Massey. 24, I think we mentioned in Wally, yep. Shot strong off the backboard, no good. And uh, 15 in great and true. So they're moving some people in and out now. That shot, good for Shendo. Here's Hunsinger. Nice little one-handed shot up and in. Tell you what, that was a good little move. And he was able to get to that baseline. <clears throat> good save there. And now the ball is going to go out of bounds. Let's see who touches it. It's going to be Cashin's ball. Over here to Noah Hemmerspach, down here to the right-hand side. Kicks out, back up to the top to Hemmerspach. Down low it goes. That is going to be Kleba, and he'll go to the line. Jack battling underneath there. First shot, rims in and out, no good. That baby looked like it was halfway down, didn't it? <clears throat> Thanks to the bank at Cashton bringing you today's action. Scott Wall taking care of business there at the bank at Cashton. Of course, our head coach here for the Eagles. Oh, well, Kleba makes one of two. It's 10 6. Cashton out on top here. They go over to Zanon. They come up here to the top with um, Shendall. Back over to Cannon. He's going to, or Cannon, Zanon, I should say. I have a Cannon camera, so you know what? I might do that again. <laughs> it is going to be Hemmerschbach over here to Hemmerschbach. Back into Brett, back out to Noah. Little give and go action, nothing happening. Now to Hunsinger. Hunsinger back up to Noah. <clears throat> Noah, cross court to Hunsinger. Inside pass to Kleba. He'll try again. This one goes. And a timeout, Sparta. 
We'll take a break ourselves. We'll be right back with more action here from Cashton. Well, a quick pass down court here is the, after that uh, timeout, trying to pick up the pace a little bit was Sparta, and now it's picked off here by Hemmerspach. Yeah, and that run-handed shot. Tell you what, they've got those floaters going for them tonight. That's got to be at least the third one that we've seen. Here comes Zanin. Shot coming over here on that far side. That was 32 in the ball game, I believe, then uh, Brigman. Coming back down the court, the Eagles, they'll put their own pressure on. The three is short, rebound coming up here by Cashin. Quick inside pass, Kleba, he's gonna be fouled. Should mention in the ball game also here is uh, Mascota, or Mascada, Mascada, I think is how they said that. Edgar, number 21. Fourteen six score. Cashton with the inbound. They zip it out here to Mosquita. And a nice shot. Oh, in and out on the bank. <laughs> Thought that was going to go for a minute for Brady Hemmersbach. Here's Noah once again. And he did it another time with that one-handed shot. He just kind of hangs in the air. Must have some pretty light shoes, huh? Bounce pass back up here to Zanon. Zanon trying to work down here, get across that timeline, just got across. Bounce pass inside, a beautiful look, and the bank is gonna go in for 25 here in Matt Richards. 16-8 the score. Doubling up, that shot's not gonna go. Rebound, put back, no. Back in it goes again to Hemmerspach, and we're gonna get a jump ball. Right there at the end, boy, that was a tough, tough play. So Sparta will inbound. They come up here with Zanon. He's not got any kind of rest tonight, I don't think so far, has he? Now another player into the ball game is Aguilar. He drops back, now takes a move, kicks it back out here to Zanon. Zanon with the open three, bit strong on the front of the rim that time. But boy, Sparta able to clean the board. That shot no good and nice work in there by Kling. Tried to get the ball down the court quickly and nearly went out of bounds. It was heading that way, but Sparta tried to save it and they actually stepped out. Here's Hunsinger up at the top of the key to Hammerspach. Brett up here now to Zach Milsna and over to uh, Brady Hammerspach. A three on the way, no, right into the hands of Hammerspach. Tried to bank it in. He was falling backwards as he was going to do that. 
Out of the ball, out of bounds, last touch there by uh, Brett. Brett Hammerspark. Here is a quick pass down to Aguilar, and they'll come away with it off from the miss. That is Brett. They'll come right back up to Millsden. Now got his own rebound, put back up and in. Nice work in there. Zach Mills now following the play, and that's exactly what you got to do. Here's a little move down the sideline on that far sideline. Now the handoff, we're going to get a foul, a travel. Okay. Wasn't quite sure what they were going to do on that one. Number two, Pitsenbarger into the game. Here's a three. That's a little strong. Inside pass, trying to get it into Milsna. Hammersbach wound up throwing that one into a bit of a crowd. And a timeout on the floor here. It's going to be a full timeout for Sparta. We'll be right back. All right, let's take a look here. It's 18-8. We come back, a little action going on, but 32 into the ball game here. And Brigaman back up to uh, Pitsenbarger. There's a bank in and out, no good. That was 25 in Richards. Now a travel call here. That was on Brady Hammersbach. Zanon now with the ball off from that inbound pass from, uh, I believe it was Aguilar. A shot up, Brigaman, boy. No problem with that shot as he hits the three and it winds up 18 11. Seven and a half minutes to go here in this first half action. Our thanks going out to Bobby Johns in the Cashin, located on Front Street. Sue Brigan and her team, Cashin Farm Supply, Ernie Peterson. Organic farming needs out there on Highway 27. Quick pass to Aguilar. He had to stop and kind of reach back for it. Then he comes right back up near the half court. Over here, and it's a long three, no good. And uh, lost the handle was Kling. Oh, what a pass. Two great passes. And the layup, and it's good. Hunsinger on the receiving end of the final pass. They were really zipping that ball around. Good job in there. Both Hemmerspachs. Noah Hemmerspach coming back into the game. He comes in for uh, Brady. Yeah, Brady and Brett both with some nice catches and quick passes. 
Then Hunsinger was at the receiving end for the layup. Hunsinger not able to make the three-point play. And Sparta coming down the court here. Yeah, set up shop here on their side, looking down to that corner. That was to 15 and true. Back up here on the wing. And uh, Kling battling here. Now we're going to get a reach in. That's going to go on Brett Hemmerspach. Oh, thanks also going out to Coon Valley Telecommunications where you're watching tonight's ball game on their channel too. <clears throat> Thank them uh, tremendously with all of our sponsors for that matter. Shot is up, no good. That was uh, uh, Pitsenbarger trying to hustle down the floor. It's going to go out of bounds. Kling was really moving. Ball last touch there by the Eagles, so Sparta will inbound. Able to find the handle. That is uh, Pitsenbarger. Barger, I think is how they say it. Barger. <laughs> His shot might have been partially touched there. Hunsinger coming away with the ball, and now a long pass picked off. Sparta wastes no time getting down the court. Hunsinger with the handle. He throws the rock down to Hemmerspach. He looks to take it himself, and he's going to get it to drop. Wow, quite a play there. And uh, Brett Hemmerspach with his first bucket of the night. And he'll go to the line. Taking a look at more of those sponsors. Culver's of Oroqua supporting the broadcast as well as Evinger's Equipment Sales and Service both on the north side of Oroqua. Well, that uh, free throw not going to happen. And we're going to get a foul in here. I think that might have went on Kling. That's number two on him. So Mills will come in for Kling. Baseball pass. Wow, look at that goal. And uh, trying to make the shot on the fly was Zanon. It was actually behind the basket. Behind the backboard, for that matter. Milsna comes back up here. Try to go right back inside to kick it out. Noah Hammerspach with the drive. Nope. And Milsna got reached up and got the rebound. Then the ball disappeared over on the far side and it got away from the Eagles. A little bit of a tough break right there for him. <clears throat> Zanon over here to the near side, a three on the way. That was a nice looking shot by Massey. Here comes Cashton, Hunsinger, no, got his own rebound. He'll put it back, and he's going to be fouled. Well, the action getting a little tougher underneath there all of a sudden. Very physical. Now 10 team fouls, fouls here for Sparta with 5-12 to go. That's going to put, it was a shooting foul here anyways, but that one's strong. But from here on out, it's going to put, the Eagles on the line every time Sparta 
is a flag for a foul. <clears throat> 23 14 with 5 11 to go. First half action. Sparta keeping it close here. Cashin with that swarming defense. Tell you what, they do a really nice job of getting around and getting after people. There's a good rebound by Noah Hemmerspach and the quick pass down to Brett and out of bounds it goes. Should stay with uh, Cashton here as Hunsinger will come down. Gonna get a jump ball situation, a tie up. The arrow says Eagles. Hunsinger to get the ball in. Embroidery and more, Greg Danes and crew in Westby. 210D Swigham Road bringing you today's action. Wow, what a job there by Kleba as he was able to muscle that one up and in. That was not, <laughs> excuse me, an easy shot, <coughs> but he stayed with it. Zanon now moving to the right side, comes back to the left, down the middle of the court. He'll do the one-handed shot, and it worked for him. He probably said, well, if Noah Hemmerspach has hit three of them, why not me? Well, let's see, take a look there. That was uh, Brady Hemmerspach with the two. Down that far corner it goes. Bounce pass up here to Massey and back to Zanon. Now into the ball game, a new player. This is number 20 in J.D. Olson. We hadn't seen him yet. Zach Milsna finally corralled the ball. There he got it again, couldn't get that one to drop. Gonna get a whistle here, and we might have a foul. We'll have to wait and see. Yep, it's gonna be a foul called on somebody. They have Zach Milsner's number up there. He might have reached in, snagged an arm. Seventh team foul now for the Eagles, so it'll be a one and one situation. Zanon with the shot, drops that one in. Second one will just eke over and drop through also. And now the timeout here by Cashton. We'll take a break, come back with more here from Eagle Territory. the Eagles <clears throat> with the ball come across the timeline with the Hemmerschbach boys 
That was uh, Noah first, and then uh, Brady right here. Back up to the top with Mosqueda. Here's a good shot dropping over. It just would not fall by Kleba. Zanon finds a wide open number 24 here in Wally. And he hit the first couple of shots of the ball game. It was tied at five apiece after he hit his three. And he's been pretty quiet since. There's crashing of the boards once again by Cashton. Kling over here to Brady. Back to uh, Brady. This is going to be a shot. No. Kling coming away with it. Back up to the top. Brady to Edgar and back over here to Brady. And now the ball tipped out of bounds. <clears throat> They're going to say it stays or it gets to go now back to Sparta. Into the ball game and replacing 24 and Wally is uh, Pitzenbarger. Barger. Well, the more I look at that, it might be Barger. <laughs> I guess I'll just try and pick a name and go with it, right? Bounce pass down low. Didn't expect that pass. And still was able to be saved by Sparta. Back into the hands of Zana, and he kicks it out just in time. Trying to go inside. The ball tipped out of bounds here by Hemmerspach. Brady down low doing a nice job of getting that away from everybody. But not into the hands of a Eagle. Here's a good look and he hit it. Oh, he was wide open on that. True gets a three. Here comes Hemmerspach, 27-21. Slow but sure, says Sparta. They've worked themselves right back into this ball game. Two possession game, actually, when you think about it. Shot went up over the top on the weak side, rebound. Inside pass, and it's tipped away into the hands of Hunsinger. Jacob brings the ball down the court. Nah, they're going to get him for a travel. He got bumped as he came across the timeline, and there's a kick by Hemmerspach. Quick reaction there. Thanks to uh, Gunnarsson Health, the Viroqua Clinic bringing you today's action. We also want to say thanks to, how about, uh, how about Gasser's Bar and Grill? My goodness, what a job Tala is doing down there. Oh, check out the Friday Night Fish, yes. That ball tipped away. Oh, wanted to get the pass, but Hemmerspach had fallen down. He got tripped up. Main Street Mobile Mart bringing you tonight's action with 16 seconds remaining in the half. Lob pass out to the top here. See if the Eagles are going to look for that last shot here in a six-point lead. Trying to add to it. Inside, nice play. Couldn't quite get it to go. And time is going to run out. Wow. Surprised they didn't get the... Uh, one coach says a foul, another coach says a travel. That's what I thought, <laughs> but I'm just up here. That's okay. Main Street Mobile Mart helping us out. Of course, Synergy Mobile Few and Nordic Lanes right there in uh, just outside of Westby. We thank uh, Sue and Scott Sordahl 
along with uh, Westby's Premier Co-op and Senex Gasoline. Right Choice Construction, that's Rich and his great crew with... Um, when they get the ch uh, when you get the chance, uh, it is free estimates by them. Let's take a real quick break. I'm going to add up some points, and we'll be re right back with the totals scoring in the first half. Taking a quick look at the uh, scoring here <clears throat> at the uh, half for Sparta. Zanon with four points, True with three, Massey with three, Wally with five, Richards two, Brigaman three, and Shendo one for their 21 points. Meanwhile, Cashton with Hemmerschbach at seven. That's Noah, Brady with two, Brett with two, Hammerschbox, Jacob Unsinger with six, Jack Kleba with five, Lincoln Kling with three, and Zach Milsna with a bucket for two. There you have the scoring so far here in the first half. Thanks to the Riverbank bringing you today's action. Katie Helseth uh, managing both the Riverbanks in Westby and Coon Valley. And our thanks to right here in uh, Cashin Scenic Bluffs Community Health Care. Appreciate all that uh, Ray Freiberg and her terrific crew continues to do for the area. And we'll take a break here. We want to say thanks to Sleepy Hollow, Ford, Buick, Dodge, Ram, you name it. They got a ton of vehicles for you on the north side of Morocco. We'll be back with more here from Cashin in just a little bit.
Well, second half action, here we go. <clears throat> this will be Zanon with the ball. Looking over here to the left-hand side in his drive, Hunsinger doing all he can to kind of like impede that progress, I guess you could say, right? <laughs> He'll come back to Zanon. He's going to look at a three. Off the front of the rim, no good. Rebound put back up and still no good. Nice bounce pass. Wow. Zanon took the ball and had a bounce pass right into Massey, who laid it up and in. It's 27 23. So the uh, Spartans really doing a great job of coming back here. They were down by a bunch. At least 11 or 12 at one point. You wouldn't know it now. Here's Hunsinger. That ball tipped, but uh, no call. You can see the, that it was altered a little bit. Now down low again to Massey. They'll come right back out to the top. Zanon over the far side with the drive. The shot up, no good. <laughs> Excuse me, that was 15 in true, and now we're going to get a foul on uh, Sparta. Somebody holding on to uh, Hemmerspach, I think. Here's the uh, pass. I'll come back out to the top here with Hemmerspach's. Noah at the top. Now it's going to be Brady going inside. Right back to Brett. <coughs> Hunsinger. Trying to make a move on the baseline. No. Now it's Kling. His shot. No. And ball bounced right into the hands <laughs> of Shendo. And he was standing out of bounds. And he went, wait a minute. <laughs> the reaction uh, that he had, body language, was it was uh, kind of funny. Inside play, they're going to, no, they're going to say the foul was on the floor, not on the shot. <clears throat> so it's going to be Hunsinger to inbound. Back to Hunsinger, and now a nice layup here. Boy, a little... Two-man show with Hunsinger and uh, Brett. Brett Hemmerspach. And Brett was able to uh, get the layup. Brady right underneath this. I apologize. I was watching to see. <laughs> I was paying more attention watching the play than putting the camera on it. Here's a steal and a layup. That was a very uh, quick move there by Brett Hammerspach. Trying to come up with a steal again was Brett, but this time Brett might be hit with the foul. I think he is. Tried to cut, cut off the path... Uh, to uh, Shendo, he's going to pick up foul number one. That ball tipped again by the quick hands of Brett Hemmerspach. Well, Snowflake Ski and Golf, they remind you to stop down Steve Clement for that Fantastic uh, fish fry that they have on Friday nights. Now, boy, tell you what, getting some quick action. How did he get through there? No idea. But uh, coming up on the receiving end was uh, 23 in Massey. Picking up the bucket and now a timeout here on the floor.
Cashin will inbound underneath their own basket. Or check that underneath the um, Sparta basket. We're in the second half. <laughs> here is the play up here to Hemmerschbach and over to Brett. Now it's going to be Hunsinger back to Noah Hemmerschbach. He had a terrific look at the three, and he put that one down the bottom of the netting. Zanon will look to try and get across the timeline here. Brady Hemmerschbach, now Brett. Both, he slipped between both of them. Zanon bounce pass inside Massey. Couldn't get that one to drop. And coming away with it was Hemmerschbach. Brett quickly down the floor. He'll slow things down over to Noah, back to Brett. Baseline. Oh, ball was tipped. He wanted to go into Hunsinger. Couldn't quite get there. Aguilar with the play, and he will be fouled. Aguilar will go with the layup. Went with the layup and got hit from the side by number 12 in uh, Brady Hemmerschbach. Aguilar hits his first. He's a freshman, by the way. <clears throat> Zach Milsna back into the ball game. Aguilar gets both. 34-27. Sparta hanging around. And uh, nearly come up with a foul here, or a, a steal, but I think we're going to get a foul instead. Jack Kleba will inbound below us. He'll go to Hemmerschbach. Nearly stolen away by Zanon. Zanon has got some uh, good instincts. Unsinger back up to the top. Noah to Brett. Inside to Jack Kleba. Bounce pass picked off. Tipped away there. Wanted to get inside to Milsna. Now here is Hemmerspach. He gets the layup. Off from the steal. That young man has uh, some very quick hands. Good anticipation. That ball is blocked by Noah Hemmerspach. Eight points tonight so far for Brett Hemmerspach. Six of them here in the second half. <laughs> Picking up play, I guess, right? Shot no good. Thought maybe he might try again in uh, Brigham. No, still not going to go. Lob pass down to Hunsinger, and that's going to drop in. Boy, he uh, great control with his body, and was knew he was going to be fouled. Shot was off the front of the rim. Not able to get that three-point play. Cashton, I would guess, going to look back, and no matter what happens, they're going to say, we left too many points out there on those free throws. Here is Kling. Oh, thought he was going get to get his three. Didn't happen.
Hunsinger will pass in. That was to Noah. Milsna back up the top here. Now on the wing is Hunsinger. Inside pass tipped away. Here's Aguilar, tried to lay it up, and he hung his hand out there a little too long, and it's swatted away by Noah Hemmerschbach. That shot off the back, no. Oh, nice play there. Nice little pass by Jake Wall. Got it in to Kling, and then it was just an easy little layup. One thing I will say about Cashton, they play very, a very unselfish style of basketball. They see somebody who's got a chance to score, they're going to get the ball to them. Somebody... Uh, Got a foul in there on Sparta. We'll see if it's who it's going to go against. They're going to say Aguilar. It looks like here at the 9-10 mark. Milsna couldn't get that one to fall for him. Pitsenberger had the rebound. Shot, no. That's going to go out of bounds. Woof. Hunsinger will come out of the game as the uh, Twins come back in. That's Brett. <clears throat> nice pass inside. And, oh, Milsna looked like he was going to get a nice bucket right there, and somehow it just would not fall down. His first shot off the front. Well, he, he banked that one in, but he stepped across the line. Milsna and Wall will come out. And it's Kleba back into the ball game. Let's see who else we have in there now into the game. Number 32 in Riley Verkin. I believe this is Riley's first opportunity to play. That ball tipped away. Good, good look. And oh, couldn't get the shot to drop. Boy, both Brett and Brady, both. Brett had the look and then Brady and... Neither one of them could get it to drop. They might have to give each other the devil there, right? Well, probably their dad. <laughs> Time out. We'll do the same. Thanks to Vernon Communications bringing you tonight's action here from Cashton. We also want to say thanks going out to uh, Vernon Electric Cooperative out there on Songstead Road, just outside of Westby, Highway 27 there, of course. 4027, the Eagles have rebuilt a 13 point advantage. There's a steal. Kleba is going to be fouled as he went to the bucket. Nice aggressive move there. You get kind of sense he was waiting for the impact and trying to see which side maybe it was going to come from. And then he just went for the layup.
taking a look as players come rotating in. Shendo and Zanon return. And Wally for Sparta. Kleba gets one of two. Tried to save that one was Brady. Now Brett comes in for Brady. Kleba out front there. The ball finally is tossed into Zanon, and he'll work against Noah Hemmerspach. He's got some skills dribbling, that's for sure. And a good draw, uh, job there on that drive by Braden True. There's a foul in here. I'm not sure who that went on. Almost think it was uh, Hemmerspach on the backside. Going for the ball. Only the third team foul here. Cashton doing a nice job not getting fouls. Now there might be uh, might be one there, but really when you look at this, it's they do a great job with things and they're all over the place when it comes to defense. They're like bees swarming after you. Here's a shot. Whoa. Nice shot there by Wally. And there's a good hit. I hope I got that one just in time. Cashton running the court well. And we're going to get a push underneath. Some wholesale changes coming up here for Cashton. Hunsinger back in. Jack Wall returns. Mills now. And let's see. Those are the three I believe that came in. Maybe Noah came in. That was, uh, it's going to be a foul on Hemmerspach out there on the wing. That's foul number four with him. And Brett will come out of the game, or check that. Brady will come out of the game, and Brett comes in. That's an air ball right up over the top. True. Left alone, but he, he might have rushed it just a little bit. But when you're that open, you want to take that shot. Mills and I thought he had two hands on the ball. He did. But must have just caught him with the body. Thanks to Vernon Manor Health Care Center on the north side of Viroqua. That's Amanda Huff and her terrific crew. First shot, no good. Number two drops right down the pipe. Chendo with two points so far this evening. Here's a timeout. Uh, we'll take a little break ourselves.
Hunsinger will look to inbound. Over here to Hemmerspach. Back to Hunsinger, and we're going to get a foul. Kind of reaching across on that pass and got not only the ball, but part of Hunsinger, apparently. First shot is up and good for Jacob. And he'll look for the next. Our thanks going out to VMH, Vernon Memorial Healthcare. So much care, so close. Vernon Manor Healthcare, by the way, we just want to mention that that's the place to go. They've been serving Vernon County residents for well over 100 years. Here's a lob pass back up to Zan, and he comes over here to the near side. That's Shendo looking around, has to go back to Cannon. Continuing with the motion, Sparta back down to that far corner. Here's a baseline shot. Oh, strong move by Wally to get that one to drop. Quickly down the court. We're going to get a travel, apparently. True. Brought the ball across the timeline. Here's True again. Kicks it out. Shendo. Oh, he banked that one in from the side. How does that happen? Got to have the right angle and touch, I guess, huh? And it's uh, another comeback attempt here by the uh, by the Spartans. Hunsinger will inbound on a 45-37 ball game with four, excuse me, five, now 5-15 left here in the ball game. Sparta just not going away, are they? Had a 13-point advantage at one time. Now Hunsinger is going to be fouled. And they've uh, chopped it down to this eight-point margin. Hunsinger drops the first one in. Second one also. Here comes True. He turns around, spins back. Oh, just off the fingertip of uh, Hunsinger. And look at that. A three by Massey. Here comes Hemmerspach, 47-40. And we got a timeout here for the Eagles, just in time probably also.
Well, the Eagles trying to hold off Sparta. 442 remaining. Our thanks going out to the VFW of Viroqua. They're located, of course, on the south side of the city. Hemmerspach getting the ball across the timeline. True guarding him. Kleba back over to uh, now Brady and Hunsinger. Up to Kleba. Jack over here to Brett. Trying to run a little time off the clock. If they can get a good layup, guess what? They'll go on the attack. Brett with, or Brady with the ball comes up here. We're going to get a foul on uh, Massey. Kind of crawled up the back of Kleba. Thanks to the Roka Booster Club bringing you tonight's action. Kleba rattles that first one in. We don't care how, just that they go, right? That one off the back of the rim, but the long rebound right into the hands of Hemmerspot. Brady goes into Brett, and Brett laid it up and in. True, goes to the left side. Here's a three, back back of the rim, and a beautiful job getting that rebound was Kleba. Here is Hemmerspach, no, into the hands of Kleba. His shot, no, put back up, no. And Massey came down with it. He hands it off to Zanon. Zanon on a quick bounce pass. Oh, I tell you what, that was great eyes right there from Zanon. Now, Cashton trying to get the ball in. Here's Hunsinger. That ball was blocked. 50-42. Hitting a three-minute mark of this ball game. Here's a steal once again. That one's not going to drop. Going to get a jump ball. It favors Cashton. With the Viroqua Dental Center, Dr. Leanne Klum on the north side of Viroqua, right behind Sleepy Hollow for your next beautiful smile. White ball. Well, the place to go for all your organic groceries is the Viroqua Food Co-op. What a job they continue to do for folks. A terrific uh, display and I mean selections. It's just crazy. They'll kick things back out. Here's Hunsinger. He's going to be gang tackled by True with 2.23 to go. Ten team fouls, so everything here is two shots. Hunsinger gets the first. Back into the ball game comes Brigaman. Jacob Hunsinger, pretty cool under pressure there. He has hit uh, six, six free throws in a row. They best not foul him. The foul that was just called was on Noah Hemmerspach. True is able to get the first one down. Six points for him so far. Missed that one and Hunsinger was there. 
Gets it up to Brett. Make that Brady. Now to Brett. Back over here to Brady. Goes inside. Kleba. Jump ball situation. True played that defense very well. The ball lost, and here comes a chance for a bucket. Oh, they finally got it to drop. <laughs> that was Brett Hemmerschbach. It had to think about it before deciding to drop down the cylinder. Thanks to uh, the Vasateg Funeral Home, located in Viroqua, Westby, and surrounding communities. Hammerspach didn't get that one, but Brady was able to pick up the rebound. Now a foul here as Noah, trying to get away from uh, True, couldn't outrace him on that one. Thanks to the Westby Co-op Creamery, of course that new store for them and right in the heart of Westby itself, for terrific dairy selections. And WCCU, the Westby Co-op Credit Union, helping out once again. Right here in Cashton, Westby, Verocla, down in Coon Valley also. Well, it couldn't get that one to drop, so Sparta with the rebound. Under a minute to go, Aguilar thought about the three, then drives and dishes off. Back to Aguilar as the ball bounces around. And speaking of bouncing around, we're gonna get a foul here. See if that's on, uh, that might be on Verkin. It is, and it's number two on him. Aguilar gets the first. His points so far tonight have come off from the free throws. Did not get that one. Kling out maneuvers to get the rebound. Hammerspock is time down to that, uh, pushing at 30 seconds now. Gonna get a little shove over here. That's J.D. Olson with the foul. First shot, no good. The second one is spot on for Brady. Aguilar coming down the court here. Time running out. They want to shoot as many as they can. Good put back. Nope, not there. Back out it goes into the hands of Hammerspach. And we'll see. They're just going to run the clock out here. Tonight, Noah Hammerspach. Comes up with 10 points here for the Eagles. Brady with three. 12 points for Brett. Uh, eight, uh, 14 points for Jacob Hunsinger. Kleba with two, four, six, seven. Seven for Lincoln Kling and two for Zach Milsna. The final score, 55-44 here on the JV side for the Eagles. And uh, leading the way for Sparta, it looked like it's uh, Massey with, um, there's six, uh, with 10 points tonight. Uh, followed close behind with Wally. He had 
uh, two, four, six. He had nine in uh, the losing cause. But 55-44 is your final score. We hope that you've enjoyed this Western Wisconsin Video Production LLC of Cashion Boys Basketball.